Hi everyone, I'm Jasmine and this is Breakthrough in English. Today's lesson is fashion. To start off, I think I should be honest and say I'm not exactly a fashion expert. Someone who is really passionate about fashion is a fashionista. Fashionistas are fashionable, which means they are trendy, stylish, or chic. You're always so stylish. I know, right? The opposite of fashionable is unfashionable, old-fashioned, or frumpy. You're always so... frumpy. I know. To commit a fashion faux pas means to wear something very unfashionable like crocs and socks, or stripes and polka dots. An item of clothing that is fashionable is in style or in fashion. Leather jackets are so in style now. Yeah. Clothing can also go out of style, which means that it's no longer fashionable. Didn't you know? Leather jackets went out of style last month. What? Another expression with the word style is have a sense of style. This simply means that you know your fashion preferences. I would say I have a really unique sense of style. Yes. Yes, it is unique. Yeah. Fashion, like the weather, has seasons. For each natural season, summer, spring, fall, winter, Fashion has a change in trends. This winter season, we have snow, snow, and more snow, with a low temperature of minus 25. This fashion season features striped scarves and jean jackets. If everyone wears a particular style, it is called a trend. A trend setter is someone who starts trends, like celebrities. And a trend follower is everyone else who imitates the trend setter. I think I'm gonna wear my scarf like this now. OMG, me too. <sighs> Every once in a while, a particular style becomes very popular and everyone and their dog is wearing it. This is called a fad or a craze because everyone is crazy about it. Me, me, so me. When clothing stores get new, trendy merchandise or items, you will often see the words hot new trend or must have. This hat is a must have item. I simply must have it. Finally, the phrase make a fashion statement is when you wear something unusual or something that will draw attention to yourself. Hello. I'd like to make a fashion statement. Oh, sure, sure. Go ahead. Well, I've, I've already made it. Oh, yes, yes. Yes, I see. Okay. Okay, let's talk about clothes. Formal words for clothes include apparel, attire, and wear. These words are used usually to describe a specific type of clothing. Like sports apparel, winter attire, and swimwear. A single piece of clothing is a garment. A set of clothes that you wear all together is an outfit. Wow, cute outfit. Thanks. <laughs> Informal words for outfit include garb and get up. What exactly is that get up supposed to be? Oh, I'm going for a executive meets Hawaii. Secondhand clothing is clothing that has already been worn or used. A hand-me-down is a piece of clothing that your older brother or sister used to wear, and now you have to wear it. But mom, I don't like the color blue. <laughs> Accessories are non-clothing items that you wear or hold, such as jewelry, belts, hats, and shoes. To accessorize means to wear accessories. 
I just love the way you accessorize. I know, right? Accessorizing is truly an art. If someone dresses really nicely, you can say that they look smart or sharp. Or you can say they are dressed to kill. This is my murder outfit. Not actually. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, please give it a like, and please share with your friends. Lots of love!